November 29th, 2008. Any chance of any injuries, death, fallen, harnesses must be utilized, must be worn at all times. The day begins at 5.30 in the morning. Ultimately, there will be over 180 people on this site. Safety is important. Well, we're witnessing what we call a raft slab foundation pour. It's a 4,100 meter concrete pour. This is the largest pour in North America out of Vigilia. If you've ever moved concrete, it's very heavy, very difficult to move. It takes a lot of manual labor. The way we're doing it here is to use a very ultra fluid concrete. So what you'll see is you'll see a product that looks much more like water in its flow. There's 120 trucks on the road right now. At any given time, there's, uh, I, I believe there's 40 in the close proximity of the site. The volume that's being placed today is about 450 meters uh, an hour. When we started this morning at seven o'clock, uh, by 9.30, we'd already managed to batch over one and a half thousand cubic meters. Uh, we already have over a thousand meters into the ground at the moment, and we're two and a half hours into the pour. So again, that, that shows you the capabilities of this product. With a standard concrete, it would be much harder to do that. So we've taken the approach that we have to think out of the box. This is something we've never done before. Uh, there's never been a five-star luxury hotel built in the city of Toronto. This isn't the same old, same old. And really, a lot of the things we're doing here, no one's ever done in Toronto before. Nearly 500 truckloads of concrete are moved to the site over the course of 12 hours. You just look at the people around the site. There's a lot of smiling faces because you know what? We're, the concrete's flowing on time. The trucks are moving. The, the placement is, is just optimum. So it's great. It's great for our first major pour. But on this day, in the dark of twilight, it's a good day. We've got about five or six trucks to come. We're at our limit. And? Good day for everybody today. There's a real, real win. It's a team win. We pushed, we pushed everybody to get here today. This was, a, this was the, the 29th was a do or die day for us. There was no question, there was no, there was no, there was no backup plan in terms of getting this in before Christmas. Look at the guys still here. We probably got more spectators here than the Leafs will have tonight. I look, I look at all the smiles on these faces. I won't predict that there may, there'll be as many smiles on the Leaf fans tonight as ours.